Plus, those cases begin to spike a growing number of businesses now requiring customers to prove that they have been vaccinated. Kick and Ice Candace Crone has that story tonight. The sound of a shaken drink echoed through Permanent Records Roadhouse, where live music and vinyl records greet customers on a daily basis. Today, patrons had to show their vaccination cards at the Cypress Park business for the first time in order to gain entry due to rising COVID-19 cases. The decision was a difficult one to make, but uh, out of solidarity with other local bars that have gone this route uh, and for the protection of our staff and our patrons, we thought this was the best option. Bar owner Lance Barisi said he's on board to do everything he can to stop the spread even if it means turning customers away who cannot show proof they've been fully vaccinated. We'd ask them to come back another time. There's plenty of other options if you uh, are just looking for a drink. Uh, we can also serve if you want records. We can sell you the records at the door. Just today, my friend who had the Pfizer vaccine tested positive, so it, it's a little bit scary. Keegan DeWitt is concerned about breakthrough cases of COVID-19 among vaccinated people. Customers say the added safety measures only assure folks can hang out together safely in person. That makes me feel a lot more comfortable, and I want to st support establishments that kind of are looking out for the best interests of their patrons and their staff to keep them safe. So I'm all for it. An ER nurse we spoke with says it's possible to have a nice night out and protect yourself and friends from COVID while doing so. I think it's understandable. A lot of people have a lot of fears with any vaccination, so I understand. But really, there shouldn't be this much fear. We've had so many people, hundreds of thousands, if not millions, already vaccinated in L.A. County alone. And that just goes to show the safety of it. And the owner of the bar told me that he's received support from several other businesses in the area. Everyone's saying that it's up to them to do their part to help fight COVID-19. In Cypress Park, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.